From Wall Street to Main Street, this is LA Late. It's a big evening of Evenings LA. As huge news is released, that huge news of the retail sales. And they were a miss. Oh my goodness, how did that happen? <laughs> the retail sales were released before sunrise and featured on the third short ever on this channel. A hit show right now airing. The retail sales miss, meaning the number declined. Inflation went down. When looking at the what estimates were, overall it was an, an, an unchanged number when Wall Street was looking for a rise across the board. Comes in a week in which the CPI was up, the PPI was up, and your lifetime of benefits are up. Largest lift of your benefits in 40 years. I'll be going over that LSC lifetime subject later in this recording. But the great news is that there's massive stimulus checks for your life tonight. FSCs, Federal Relief Stimulus Checks. Stay in the big second half as we go over all these incredible checks. There's $300,000 of them and 300 checks. We'll go over everything you need to know about these FSCs in that big second half. Then we'll be turning to those ISC, Inflation Relief Stimulus Checks. How do they work and where you get them? They're coming up in the big second half. But a lot of breaking news we're dealing with tonight as J.B. Morgan, J.P. Morgan Chase's head, Jamie Dimon, says that people are going to be on the wrong side of the equation and we don't particularly know who that is just yet. What does he mean? I'll analyze the comments that he had minutes ago. They're brilliant. Then we have another report that says that the liquidity levels of investors are the highest levels ever, meaning that people do not have things invested they have in cash. Is that good or bad? All the latest details of what you need to know. Plus, we'll be looking at why some corporations missed and some companies really beat in today's huge earnings recessions report. It's coming up in today's recording from the shores of Santa Monica, California. Plus, we'll be looking at what's going to come next week as we're dealing with recession, inflation, and potentially stagflation, and also potentially more layoffs. Back one company announcing a layoff tonight. I'll go over everything you need to know, but massive stimulus coming up in that big second half. From the shores of San Marcos, California, God bless. Welcome to a big night of the evening show. And from all everything you need to know, it all heats up tonight from the shores of Santa Monica, California. The breaking news from the Federal Reserve to that earnings recession, what you need to know and where it's going, it all heats up tonight, right here, right now, on Evenings. Good evening, everybody. It's a big night from the shores of San Marco, California. Hope you're having a beautiful day. And I will be with you all weekend long. So make sure you tune in. A lot of major news coming from the shores of San Marco, California that impacts your wallet. I'll have all those details this weekend on this channel. But boy, what a night it is. And welcome to another special edition of L8 this evening. The latest details started before sunrise as retail sales were released on the East Coast. And before the sun had even risen on the left, the west coast, I had that YouTube short. It's our third short ever, and boy, did you really love it. I love delivering you these YouTube shorts. They're less than 15 seconds in length to deliver the breaking news to you, and that retail sales was a shocker. It was unchanged. Wall Street was looking for retail sales for the month of September to go up, and it basically was unchanged. However, when you remove gasoline and auto, it did go up month to month. Retail sales is a fascinating number. Let's take this pen, for example. You're not buying two pens in the month of September compared to the month of August. The question is whether this one pen is more expensive. If the one pen is more expensive in the month of September, then the retail sales number would go up. Not indicative that you spent more money on two pens just because the just that the one pen is more expensive. It's a week in which that CPI went higher than expected a beat, and the PPI, the producer price index, beat as well. Those inflationary numbers teed up the big exciting news on Thursday. Lifetime stimulus. You're getting the largest lift of your benefits of a generation. 40 years we've never seen a raise of your benefits, and this is you. Congratulations. SSI, 
SSDI, Social Security, Railroad Babbitts, and Veterans Babbitts. Learned Thursday morning, and yes, I had the breaking news of that before sunrise as well, that you're getting the biggest lift in 40 years. 8.7%. Absolutely incredible. It is absolutely incredible. And one thing I want to make clear to you tonight, it's on top of your lift from the prior year as well. Last year, your lift was 5.9%. Great. But this lift of 8.7%, is on top of that. Can you imagine? Yes. Now, what makes this even better is that j Powell has made very clear that there will be inflation for the next two years. And with inflation for the next two years, that means you're going to get a lift next year and the year after that. Incredible. Also incredible. Congress passed that big bill over the summer that changed Medicare Plan B. So your benefits will not be eaten up by medical insurance anymore. Congratulations. We'll be going over more about these lifetime stimulus LLCs in just a second. But let's turn to the other breaking news that we're dealing with tonight. From Wall Street to Main Street, everything you need to know happening this evening. J.P. Morgan Chase's head, Jamie Dimon, had fascinating comments tonight. He said some people were going to be on the wrong side of the equation. He said there are some liquidity problems in this market, but we don't know where they are, and they're not pervasive across the entire industry. So what does this mean? Let me explain what's going on. He says, my experience in life is when you have things that happen, is that when it has been when you have things that were going to happen like they see today, there were going to be other surprises. He basically says get ready for other financial surprises from this market. My I'm surprised to see, however, this is Jamie Dimon again, head of J.P. Morgan Chase, how much leverage, that's debt, that there is in some of the pension plans, referring to the pension plans in England. England had to step in over tonight and, and hold up, um, support some of these pension plans are in big trouble. But then he went back to uh, analyze the situation in the United States and compared it and says, yes, there's going to be some offsides here where people have too much debt and they're going to be in trouble. We don't see anything that looks systematic at the moment. So he says, I don't see anything that's the, the full industry wide, but I do see some pops here and left. There is some leverage in certain credit portfolios, but the leverage is in certain companies. So you're probably going to see some of that. But as to the banking industry, no, extraordinarily strong. So let me analyze this. Let me explain to you what he's saying. He's basically saying, as a big, big bank guy, he sees some corporations have way too much debt. And that debt is going to get them into big trouble as j Powell raises rates over the next few months, the remainder of this year, next year, and the year after that. But in the same industry, he doesn't see multiple companies doing the same thing. He just sees sporadic instances, so not systematic, not, not like a system. Number two, it's corporations, it's not mom and pops, and it's absolutely not the banking industry. This is great news for you. So do not worry about your money in the bank. He talked about that as well. The U.S. banking system tonight, folks, is extraordinarily strong. That's a comment from J.P. Morgan Chase, the CEO, Jamie Dimon. He says this is because of regulations put in during the savings and loan debacle decades ago. He says the 2008 financial crisis reforms made the markets more stable, even though we're going to have some volatility as the Federal Reserve raises uh, rates and balance sheets go left and right. Wow. It was a fascinating day in which you saw things like that happen. Albertsons is being bought by Kroger, the parent company of Ralph's. But will the deal go through? Well, Albertsons was down 7%. There's concerns about antitrust across the board. J.P. Morgan Chase reported its corporate earnings, and here you go. Major beat. They beat after their income surged 34% in the third quarter. My goodness, Jamie, congratulations. The bank is up 3% in pre-market trading. Morgan Stanley was up 5% in pre-market, well, was down 5% in pre-market trading after it missed. So there you go. Two similar banks, one beating and one really missing. Citibank rose as it beat, and Wells Fargo up 3% after it beat really well across the board. And finally, Wells Fargo to Delta. What do you think the airlines are doing? Do you think the airlines are reporting great earnings for the third quarter? Jump in the live chat. Airlines, good airlines, bad. I'll be going over your answer in just a sec second. But this, my friends, is why you want to get that four stimulus check in every U.S. state. The incredible great news is there's massive stimulus right now for you. And in this recording, we're going to go over these incredible stimulus items. Let's go over a preview of them starting right now. FSC. 
federal stimulus checks are now law. They've been law since the month of March. These are checks from Congress, from the President of the United States, from the federal government, sent out, managed, and paid by the federal government. Nothing to do with your states. How many checks? 300 checks, up to $300,000. We'll go over the latest details of the incredible checks in just a second, in the big second half. Then, lifetime stimulus, because once your benefits go up, they never go down. We'll go over more about these raises of your benefits we learned this week on October 13th. Next up, inflation stimulus checks, inflation relief stimulus checks, ISCs. These are from your state, and they're absolutely incredible. We'll go over everything you need to know about those incredible checks in just a second. But let's go back into that question I had for you. Do you believe the airlines are up or down in their earnings number for the third quarter? If you said up, you've been listening really well. Airlines is indicative of one of those industries that's doing really well in this economy, travel and leisure. And so you'll likely see corporations like Delta United American beat on earnings for third quarter. And I think you're likely to see it for fourth quarter as well. Absolutely. Hotels as well. But other industries are falling apart. Let's look at some of the industries that are not doing well tonight. Consumer staples. Beyond Meat is trimming the fat of its workforce. <laughs> Beyond Meat is, is cutting 19% of its workforce tonight. The stock was down 7%. And um, we had the NASDAQ um, which is uh, downgraded by Bank of America. That's the parent operator of the NASDAQ trading exchange. That was down 5%. Tesla auto manufacturer. Beat or miss, up or down. Jump in the live chat. Well, if you said down, you got it right. Tesla had gone three for one stock split several months ago when it was a $1,000 stock. Smelling it three ways means it's a $300 stock. Tonight, Wells Fargo saying it's going to 230 that's a massive loss of value. The stock was down 6% in pre-market trading. And this is why you really want to be on the right side of the equation, says J.B. Morgan. head. We have a great series of comments coming in tonight. From Mark Hackett, chief investment researcher at Nationwide, he says this, according to his data, shows the highest level of cash in people's hands in institutional investors since 2001. They are out of the markets because they're on the sidelines because of the concerns about where this market's going. And this is important because you and I discussed this last night. Yesterday, the stock market was up 900 points, and I said, this is a very bad omen because people are trying to find euphoria, try to get into a mom mentality. They're going to lose their shirts because they're going to go right back down on Friday. It did. Stock market was down 300 points much of today. And we'll go over more about that in a second. But let's go back into some incredible stimulus checks. Those big stimulus checks start with those FSCs. And let's go over what they are and how it works and where they came from and how you get them. FSCs are from the federal government, like this guy, Joseph Biden, your president of the United States. And they've been law since the month of March. Everything you need to know about those FSCs start right now. It starts by you becoming a member, but let's look at how those checks work. And what's at issue? The first three checks are checks A, B, and C. These incredible checks were passed by the President of the United States by executive action in the month of March. Single individual, 75000 less, go get it. Married couple, 150000 less, go get it. If you're on benefits, go get it as well. It is $100,000. My goodness, that's incredible. Checks A, B, and C of FSCs. Stay the big second half as we go over these incredible checks. Then, King Congress passed a bill that established more FSCs. E through K. I'll go over those big checks for you in the big second half. Say the big second half. Then we had other checks of FSCs, L and M, N and O, P and Q. And they're coming up also in the big second half. That is why you want to get these incredible amounts of checks. How do you do it? You go on this video, become a member, Purple Hawk, Purple Power, and Calcino VIP. And get that incredible newsletter, which is where you apply for those incredible checks. What are you watching? You're watching LA Light, the number three most watched financial news channel in America, now with three broadcasting channels, LA Light 1 and LA Light 2 and LA Light 3 programming seven days a week. I'll be with you all weekend long. Make sure you tune in. And yes, yesterday was our entrance into YouTube Shorts and loving it. Today, before the sun even rose, one of the most watched shows of this channel today was that YouTube short, 15 seconds long, about the retail sales breaking news. You're loving it, and I'm loving delivering it to you. 
This channel's gotten more views, more money over the last two years than any broadcaster in the American landscape. $15 million. And that's why you want to be part of this incredible Purple Power community. But let's go back into that breaking news that's impacting your wallet tonight. And it starts with those comments from Hackett. Hackett, that analyst at Nationwide, says that there's a lot of cash on the sidelines. Is this a surprise? No, it should be not at all. Because we discussed this earlier this week. Hackett says that there's big conservative uh, elements at issue, not politically conservative, fiscal conservative. Institutional investors, which are banks and big corporations, remain extremely conservative. Do I agree? Absolutely, I agree. This is along with fund managers keeping cash at the highest level on the sidelines since 2001. Do I agree? Absolutely. You want to be out of the market. You don't want to be buying any stocks, buying any, um, buying any um, coins, buying any cars or real estate. And this, according to Hackett, all the cash on the sideline, will drive a sharp recovery and a potential for the upside higher than expected. Do I agree? No. Now, here he loses me. No, I do not agree. I certainly believe you can see more days like yesterday, when the stock market goes up 1,000 points, and more days like today, where the next day it goes right back down. Why? Because you're in a recession. In a recession, you, stocks go down 50%. We're not down 50% yet. And in a recession, you don't have all down days. You also have some up days. Here's more comments by Hackett. Markets have attempted to rally several times in recent weeks with no success. That's an indication of yesterday that there's going to be more rally because the degree of pessimism is priced into the markets. Do I agree? Oh, baby, I do not. Do you agree? Jump in the live chat right now. Do you believe the markets have assessed and put the risk into the markets of, you know what I'm about to ask, more interest rate spikes from Jay Powell? Do you believe the markets have assessed more risk of interest rate spikes from Jay Powell? Or do you think they're just ignoring that there will be more rates hikes from Jay Powell, who's actually said he's going to do more rate hikes? I believe they're ignoring and I do not believe that there will be more rallies because I don't believe there's going to be any more good news that's going to cause a rally. We're not going to have better economic data. We will have some sporadic, great corporate earnings like we had with United and Delta and some banks this week. But that's not grounds for a rally. And remember, yesterday was not a rally based upon any good news. It was just a rally, unsubstantiated, and it fell apart. And that, my friends, is why I want to get this incredible force stimulus checks in every U.S. state. You want to get that incredible stimulus because the financial disarray at issue exemplified by today to yes, yesterday today is exactly why you want to be conservative with your money and get as much stimulus as you can. And with that, let's jump right into that stimulus right now. Check out the first of those FSC checks. Let's look at it right now. $6,500 to $12,000. It is that wonderful check A. How do you get that wonderful check A? You become a member. Go on this video, become a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power Cow, Sino VIP. Go down under the video and join the channel and become a member. Then get that incredible newsletter Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time via the YouTube alerts. And go down to where it says check A and go right in and apply. So simple across the board. Congratulations to Spelly who got this incredible check A. It's just huge, but you're not done there yet. Go get check B. Fifteen to eighty thousand dollars. It's a four stimulus check in every U.S. state. Single individual seventy five thousand less. Go get it. Mary couple hundred fifty thousand or less. Go get it. Why would you not become a member? Here's an example why you would not. Frank Mancuso. He spent just a few dollars to become a member because that's all it costs. It's a few dollars to become a member, and look what he got in less than thirty days. He got all his money back and thousands and thousands of other dollars on top of that. He, by spending a few dollars to become a member, got 18 months of mortgages paid in less than 30 days. 18 months of utilities, 18 months of high-speed internet, bringing him to thousands of dollars he got from this channel in just a few days. Another viewer out of Florida, she got whopping 80 to 100 checks in just 30 days, nearly $100,000. That's what we do on this channel. That's why you want to become a member and get those incredible sums of money across the board. Now, you're not done with check B because you're going to go out of this video and become a member and then go down to check B in the membership newsletter. You're not done there yet. You're going to go get check C. Check C is for rent, utilities, mortgage assistance, and more. And those incredible check Cs have been on this channel for a very long time. Now, promise me things, 
promised me two things right now. One, you will stay in the big second half because we'll go over more about these incredible checks. And number two, when you do check C, you go down the membership newsletter and reach out to all 12 places. Check B. Average view of this channel right now is getting about 18 months of five checks a month. Five checks a month, the mortgage, the rent, and then the utilities. Wow. But over at check C, same thing. 18 months, about five checks is what they're averaging. But they have 12 places to reach out for those incredible check Cs. So promise me this. When you do check C, you will go down that membership newsletter where it tells you who to call, what to say, and how to say it. At 12 places, you will reach out to all 12 places. You'll get a no. And you also get a yes. So don't get discouraged by one rejection because there'll be a yes right behind it. Go down to this membership, go on this video right now and become a member. And let's look at the, some success stories. Congratulations to viewers who keep on getting big sums of money. This viewer, this viewer Deborah, this week getting $16,000. Every day there's another success story. If you haven't sent it to me on private message or post in the live chat, do it right now. Do you want $30,000 of rent? Go get check C. Look at these incredible success stories. How about other sums of money? Two viewers getting 14 months of rent just this month. How about utilities? Well, here's Mark, $6,500. His brother-in-law, $15,000. Lynn Glenn, longtime viewer, 12 months of utilities. Another viewer, 12 months of utilities. That same brother-in-law of Mark's, a quarter million dollars over 10 years from SNAP. And how about Mark himself? He was at $32,000 from accommodations of checks. He went from 32 to 50. From fifty to a hundred to one hundred and sixty-six thousand dollars, he just spent a few dollars to become a member, and he got one hundred sixty-six thousand dollars back by watching this channel. Here is Nisi, who's twenty-three thousand. She went to fifty thousand. Here is Lorraine, from one hundred five, she went to one hundred and fifty-five thousand dollars. Dragon, triple member to all three channels, longtime viewer and volunteer. She added another thirty to forty thousand, bringing her grand total to one hundred seventy thousand. And Johnny, forty-five thousand in two days, eighty thousand in three days, and then helping friends and neighbors, getting a quarter million dollars in less than two months. Just incredible success stories, and these should be yours. In the big second half, you know what we're going to do? <laughs> we're going to go over each of these incredible. FSC checks as we continue with check E in the big second half. Then we turn to that lifetime stimulus, the raise of your benefits, and breaking news on why you're likely to get more money than you even thought earlier this week. Then we turn over to the huge inflation relief stimulus checks, ISCs. Next, we'll get a preview of what to expect for this weekend and what to expect next week from the markets. Everything you need to know is just getting started and just heating up. It's a big broadcast with a lot going on, and we have a lot of stimulus for you in the big second half. Go into this video, become a member, and I'll see you back in 60 seconds as the evening's highlight continues. If you want money right now, not five days from now, and not five weeks from now, then reach out to the community page. The volunteers can help you find that money for rent and utilities. That's at news.la.com forward slash community. The community page features a series of volunteers who are viewers like you. They can help you find rent, utilities, SNAP, food benefits, mortgage assistance, and help you with eviction moratorium questions as well. Their Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram individuals reach out to them and indicate the city and state you're from, and they'll get back to you shortly. That's a community page. Volunteers working for you, viewers helping one another. Stay with LA for more. Join LA Late Daily for the excitement of the new LA Late Live Daily. The excitement starts on mornings LA Late at 9 a.m. LA Late returns at 11 a.m. daily. And then afternoons LA Late at 1 p.m. Join us daily as the excitement continues live from Santa Monica on LA Late. And the excitement continues right now 
in a big second half. On the shores of San Marcos, California, how are you? Hope you have a beautiful evening across the board, and I'm excited you're here. The programming continues throughout the night with evenings every night at 5 o'clock, Street and Stimulus at 7, Extra at 8, 9 o'clock, Sunset, and of course, Countdown at 6 o'clock. Purple Power, are you here? You are. And let's rock and roll. Let's go into some more incredible stimulus starting right now. Check E, huge. These are the continuation of those FSC checks. From Congress. Here we go. E, $7,500. Just incredible. F, $4,000. Wow. Check G, 30% off. Huge. Check H, $2,000. Wow. Check I, $8,000. My goodness. Check J, $8,000 again. Whoa. And then check K, $14,000. That is huge. FSC, Federal Relief Stimulus Checks. But we're not done there yet. I got you more checks thereafter. Stimulus L, $100,000 on average of loan interest free money. Great, great, great. And then $4,000 of grant money right behind it for M. And my favorite stimulus, $100 towards a brand new computer, tablet, or laptop. Most tablets are less than $100. So this is great. Plus brand new free internet. Oh, wow. Just wonderful. I love stimulus N. Then O, zero down payment, zero closing costs for a purchase of a brand new home. Huge. Great. Stimulus P, 3% down for a purchase of refi of an existing home. And then Q, $8,000 of closing costs. That is huge. That is your FSCs. That is your FSCs. Let's recap. Biggest federal stimulus check, $100,000. Smallest, $8,000. These are from Congress and the President. They pay for it. They run the administration. They do the application. They mail it out. Nothing to do with your state, all federal. Fastest routing time, two days. Johnny started on Monday getting $40,000 by Wednesday. By Friday, he continued. He applied at 15 places. And he got seven approved. That's how you do it, Johnny. $80,000. Over the next few weeks, he helped friends and family. He got them a quarter million dollars. That's how you do it. How about the nature of the checks? We got a check for almost everything. We got the rent. We got the utilities. We got the home repairs. We got the appliances. We got the washer dryer. We got the computer, the tablet, the car. I mean, what do we not have? Um, we don't have lobster shorts. <laughs> <laughs> but you had the YouTube short on that one last night if you missed it. People were just cracking it up. I loved it. I couldn't look at it with straight face. And there you go. That is FSCs. How do you get them? Go under this video, join the channel. Join LA1, LA2, or LA3. Go down in the membership newsletter. Deliver it from me to you. Listen carefully. 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, which is 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, which is 9 o'clock Central Standard Time, exactly on the dot. It comes exactly at that time. Go down the membership news, cl click and start applying for those incredible checks. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you go to the bell at the front of this channel to have you, all your alerts turned all on so you get the alert when the newsletter comes out. <laughs> and there you go. Now, in addition to that, we have other checks and these are inflation relief stimulus checks. Oh, they're incredible. These inflation relief stimulus checks are from your state. California, New York, everywhere across the board. And what's at issue? Well, they're about $1,000, number one. Number two, uh, they are great, number three. They're in most U.S. states. You qualify, number four. They're very simple. How do you find them? So as a member, you go down the membership newsletter, check D, like donut. It opens a brand new page. Down in check D, it'll give you a list of the states. State, and then on the amount of the check, then the website. The website for the state that runs the check issuance, direct deposit, otherwise in the mail. Click the link, it'll tell you everything about the check, huge. And then finally, lifetime stimulus checks, because once your benefits go up, they never go down. What do we learn this week, and what is more too important to understand tonight? Your benefits are going up 8.7%, but it's important to remember that's on top of the lift you already have from last year. So this is a lift on top of a lift. Moreover, j Powell's made very clear, there'll be inflation next year and the year after. So you'll get another lift on top of a lift. This is how it works. How do you calculate it exactly? Take your current check amount monthly, times it by 1.087, and that'll give you your new monthly check. 
Is there a way to sort of run the number in the top of your head without using a calculator? Absolutely. Here's the easiest way to do it. Just take your monthly check and just say, I'm getting an extra check per year, but a little bit less. Here's an example. Let's say your monthly check is $1,000. So LA said, it's just an extra check, just a little bit less. Okay, so an extra $1,000, but a little bit less, $900? Yeah, that's how you do it. Pretty simple. Uh, because that 9% or 8.7, which is basically 9%, it almost equates to an extra month and a year in which is 12 months. There you go. Pretty easy across the board. Now, remember, your benefit lift will not and no longer and never will be eaten up again by medical bills because the medical insurance under Medicare Plan B was wiped away in a big legislation over the summer that reduced the price of the medical Plan B benefits uh, premiums so you no longer have your your raise your benefits eaten up by Medicare Plan B. Just incredible across the board. For FSCs, the federal government is about to also go live on a brand new website where you can track and apply for forgiveness of your federal student loan debt. It is not live yet. I will have it for you. If you want to track it even faster than I'm tracking it, go to the Department of Education's.gov federal website. And they have alerts there, like my alerts here. And you can sign up for alerts so you get a notification when there's a new press release. Because that website will say, come in and apply to get your federal student loans forgiven. Inflation relief stimulus checks, lifetime stimulus checks, and FSCs, just huge. And this is what we're talking about and those comments tonight by those analysts. So let's go back into where we left off. The data we learned today was fascinating in those comments by Hackett and by J.P. Morgan Chase's Jamie Dimon. First, we learned that some businesses, some corporations are too debt laden. They have way too much debt and it's almost potentially dangerously too much debt. But the great news is that it's not across the entire industry in which they're in. So let's just choose an industry, industry A. Jamie Dimon has seen companies in industry A where there's one or two companies that are doing this and they're, big, they're, they're potentially setting themselves up for trouble, but he doesn't see it across the entire industry. That's great news for you, why? Because let's say you, you are employed with that big business, that big Fortune 500 company that Jamie Dimon sees that problem. They're not the, they are really the only company in that industry that's doing that. So if you do, do get laid off, you could potentially go to another job in the same industry at another employer. Number two, banks are fine. So bank liquidity levels are great. They really had those great rules put in by the savings and loan debacle of 2008. So do not worry, the money in the bank is going to disappear. Not going to happen. Number three, we really now see that there's massive cash on the sidelines. I've been detailing that for a long time on this channel, and it's only taken until recently this week, I think, that we're starting to see more analysts finally say what I told you to do back early this year. Early this year, I said, do not buy stocks. Do not buy cars. Do not buy real estate. Do not buy investments. Do not buy any more crypto unless you're trading it, like a day trading it. Do not buy it, because why? the value will fall apart. It will go down in value. And unless you have the time to watch it and trade it, which means that's your job, you're on a computer trading the stock or trading the crypto on a regular basis, do not buy it. And that's what happened today. Stocks up 900 points yesterday, down 300 points today. And all the analysts said this yesterday. What a change. I mean, it's refreshing that they've all really come over to the bright side from the dark side. <laughs> And said, it's a mistake to get too excited about this rally, said um, Greg Swanson. Yes, a great comment, Bre uh, Gre uh, Greg. Then we had Josh Brown, who I adore. He is just brilliant. What's the rush? Why put in a whole position here? What are you doing? Um, he said that on Thursday. This is, this is all comments before today's reversal. And then we had Art Hogan, who I just worship. Art Hogan said, um, nothing's really changed. What changed? This is what I'm trying to teach you. I want you, especially I think the shorts, the brand new shorts on this channel, which are 15 seconds in length, and I can throw it up you know, at, at 4 o'clock in the morning and throw up one at 8 o'clock at night if something happens. You now know the news cycle. 
because you watch LA. You watch the live show that airs 24-7, the live stream. You now know that if there's a breaking news report, I'll throw up a short. And then you know the the mass of story coverage on the on the on the tape shows, the mornings, the afternoon, the evenings, that if you see something happening, you'll think to yourself, wait, I heard all the news today from LA. Why is the market up a thousand points? This is what they're all talking about. This is what R. Hogan and everyone else and Josh Brown and myself are talking about. There was no news cycle yesterday that justified the markets up a thousand points. We only had the CPI out yesterday. The CPI was not good data. <laughs> the CPI was uh, that there's more inflation, higher than the month before, higher inflation the month of September than August. And the cycle, the new cycle was stock buying, massive stock buying. And everyone looked at it and said, excuse me, did we miss something? And it's times like that that this channel exists. Why this channel exists? Because when you see a thousand point rally up, you think to yourself, uh, did I miss something? Did Putin withdraw? Did um, did Jay Powell say he's going to stop raising rates? What, what did I miss? You missed nothing because you were watching a light. I delivered you the news and there was no news cycle. There was nothing in the news cycle in that hour, two hours since afternoons that had happened. And that's why it's so important to be on top of the events. It's really important to be on top of the events. This is not an economy to stay away from, from two days or three days or four days. This is not an economy to disappear on the weekends and show back up on Monday morning. I know the markets are generally closed on the weekends, but there's too much surprises across the board, and you sometimes need to get caught up on them across left and right. And this is why you're doing so well. If you think back on yourself, did you know six months ago what interest rate spikes were? Did you think? Did you know what the Federal Reserve did? Did you know what a CPI was? Did you know what a PPI was? Did you know what um, uh, what uh, the unemployment rate was? Did you understand what job uh, unemployment job numbers were? Yeah, you have learned an incredible amount, and this is the power of information. I saw one fascinating quote by someone just sort of off the cuff. He said, you know, um, when they when they announced the CPI on Thursday morning, which was 6 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, everyone was like this. <laughs> everyone was like staring. Is it coming? Is it coming? What's the night? It was like you're looking at the horse races. It was like you're looking at the final two minutes before the three-point kick in the game. And you're like, are they going to get it? Everyone was on the edge of the seat. And, and the commentary's remark was, you know, the CPI has been around for hundreds of years. And I've never seen a country so captivated by this data. And that's what's going on. That's why this is our family. CPI, PPI, retail sales, this is the landscape of where we are. This is the landscape of where we're going. Why? As I predicted last year, inflation was going to be 8% in this U.S. economy. I predicted by for December last year, it was this 8% in December last year. I also predicted inflation was not going to go away. It is not. As Loretta Mester said on Thursday, we've done nothing in the Federal Reserve to get inflation down. It's 8% plus. So this inflation is going to be around for two more years. Yeah, and you know what it is now at that start of that two-year cycle. Look how well-prepared you've gotten yourself. I love it. I was the first American broadcaster to report that the U.S. economy was going to suffer a recession, and I reported that in February of this year. You now understand why a recession happens and why a recession is not always consistent, that some industries fall apart later. I detail that on Afternoons Today, where I explained that the housing market, the bad data on the housing market is not going to come in until almost November, so we're not going to see that. And I also, you understand when labor falls apart, when does labor fall apart? The start of recession or end of recession? Jump in the live chat. When does labor fall apart? End of recession or, or start of recession? You know the answer. This is why you're so prepared. And imagine... You got all this preparation at the start of the equation, at the start of this downward spiral economy. You are in such a better state. Now, if you just found this channel tonight, welcome. You can get caught up. You can watch the videos and get caught up very quickly because I do repeat the subject matters, whether it's inflation, recession, stagflation, uh, interest rates. I cover it all so you'll get caught up. Number two, you're not too late to pivot. You're not too late to remove that... Uh, rampant spending at home. You're not too late to switch to locked-in interest rates 
like get rid of flexible rate interest rate instruments at home or, or just pay it off. Get rid of credit card debt where it's flexible rate interest rates. Get as much stimulus. You're way ahead of the equation. You're in a great situation. Become a member. Become a member and get all these huge sums of money. Purple Hawk, Pearl Power, Casino VIP. You know, we've talked about this since day one of this channel. Learn to earn. Stay informed, stay focused, and stay here if LA uh, for more has been my closing line on this channel since the very first day of this channel. Stay informed, stay focused, and stay here. Now, imagine someone who is not informed, who is not focused, and not trying to get any of the news information. What are they setting themselves up for? Yeah. And if that's someone that, you know, is your sister or brother, if it's someone that's your neighbor, if it's someone down the street, you're going to have to sort of distance your reaction to life cycles from them because they're on a trajectory that's going to put them in a big problem. And that big problem is not going to fix itself until they stay informed and stay focused. You're doing it right. You're staying to the second half of this video, learning everything you need to know about this economy, and there's always something brand new. Whether it's Target or Delta, whether it's Cigna Health or whether it's um, CVS Health, there's always something that's very confusing that needs to be explained, and when you understand it, you're ahead of the equation. The programming continues throughout the night on this channel. I'm looking forward to seeing you. Evenings LA falls every night at 6 o'clock with countdown, 7 o'clock stream stimulus, 8 o'clock extra, 9 o'clock sunset. Then the programming continues throughout the morning at early mornings LA at 4 a.m., which of course is after the sunrise shows at 3 and 3.30. Go under this video and become a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power, Casino VIP. Get all these incredible sums of money that you deserve. Prepare your family, prepare yourself. Get everything you need right now, whether it's check A, B, or C. Get all these incredible sums of money and get informed, stay focused, and as always, stay a valet for more.